Radio Shouty. When y'all touched down in the A, what was that like coming down here? But then y'all came down in the middle of a damn pandemic, so it wasn't the same thing. But then you realized that you was in the A when this thing the opened a back up. The A don't close down. Period. The A don't close down. Ain't no pandemic. Ain't no pandemic. If you won't play, come to the A, man. Ain't nothing shut down. I'm a, I'm expose it. What you was it like being able here, to man. network and having all of these folks at your fingertips, though, now? It's easy Wonderful. because it's, it's like... I didn't build relationships and everything is built on relationships. So I built a lot of relationships out here in the yeah. A. You know what I'm saying? And and the streets love me out here. You know, all the executives love me out here. Who could blackmail me? Who could blackball me? They, they can't do it. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Because I got relationships, the same relationship that they got over here, over there, over there. I got it out here now. Facts. So now y'all got to come here. And I didn't build a relationship here. So y'all might got to come through me. Ooh, you feel me? Ooh. And because you know, you you you, you know if you if you're a spiritual person, that's the same thing that with Joseph, the Joseph story. Mm -hmm. His brother sold him into slavery, and they wind up having to come to him, and he told him the devil meant it for bad, but God meant it for good. Exactly. He spared y'all life by making me go ahead of y'all. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So the ones who first will be last, and the ones who last will be first. You know, and I just feel like. Everything, bro, is based on relationships, bro. And a lot of these dudes got big heads, and mm. a lot of people don't want to deal with them. And I stayed humble. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So they got to come back and see me. Come on now. Money, you what has it been back. like for you uh, maneuvering in this A? You know what? I've been loving it. I have. Um, it's challenging sometimes when you don't really know anybody, and I got my twins, mm -hmm. so we still have to be back and forth. She don't know nobody, but I know everybody. But he know everybody. You ain't know nobody that's going to watch my children. <laughs> yeah. That's the only thing. <laughs> We so we to have to go back and, back and forth mm -hmm. to Memphis a lot, which is yeah. fine. It's not it's not too far away. But I love it. Um, like he said, it's just the accessibility mm -hmm. of it all, you know, and being able to move and shake. And for some reason, I feel like I've been getting more support here. Mm -hmm. I, I got here by video shoot. Yeah. People from out of nowhere came. Yeah. You know, I'm just feeling a whole lot of love because mm -hmm. I've been doing this for a long time. Too. Mm -hmm. You know, had the other party, the video party. People was there. And she been like I said, I don't know nobody out here. So I think it's, you know. The love that people had for me is it, 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 kind of like. Transferring a hug, mm -hmm. and I think that's that's how it should be. You know, if if y'all mess with me and I love something, that this part of me mess with that the same way. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's why I say, man, I appreciate you when I reach out to you. You, you know, know, I'm here like, for it's it. open arms. Yeah. You feel me? And same with Johnny. Mm -hmm. That's a relationship that I built. You yep. know what I'm saying? It's open arms. You know, and everybody that I'm dealing with, man, that's why it's so she talented. Mm -hmm. But without that, without the relationships, mm -hmm. the talent only goes so far. Those are facts, And too. see, that's what I had, the talent without the relationship, because I was blackmailed. Mm. So wow. if you black, if you blackball, blackmail, she always correct me. Yeah. But y'all know I'm from New Orleans, and we say anything. <laughs> blackball. So if you blackball or try to blackball her, huh, you're, you're a hater, because you don't even know her. You feel me? How the hell did you find yourself blackballed, though, Turk? Because, bro, it's like. A lot of these dudes are uber dick riders, man. That's what I call them. Mm. And when they see you not messing with a certain group of people, mm. not because of something you did, yeah. but because it's the best move for you. Mm -hmm. They be thinking that, well, he ain't over here and I'm still over here. I don't want to mess this relationship mm. up, even though they know it's bad for them, but they finessing. Yeah. So they they like, until the finesse run out, I'm going to pretend over here. Yeah. Mm. I could be being real. They love you when you're... Um, Fake and they hate you when you real, bro. That's just how this industry is. You yeah. feel me? So now social media stuff like Clubhouse, Up Live, Bego, all these different things have even the playing field. So now you can go around the world at a click of a button and make the same moves yeah. that they try to stop. I'm making the same moves they making now. Mm -hmm. And guess what? They moved and shut down some of them. They Ooh. got to come. Bro, I didn't made it to where they got to come through me. I'm the agent now. Come on now. They got to come through me. And God made it that way. Like, I don't, I give all glory to God, bro. Like, he put me in a position where it's this, I'm being, I'm saying it's humble. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? They got to come through me. You know what I'm saying? Fact. And I always say that that's how it was going to happen, you know? But when they come, I'm open on because that's the type of person I am. Yeah, you did what you did. You ain't know no better. Yeah. yeah. You gonna, it gonna eat you up, though. 
Come on mm-hmm. now. They gonna eat you up because I ain't gonna treat you like you treated me. You feel me? Because I, I want my blessings. I know we need them. I know from if I can't let you take away my blessings from me being, getting revenge on you. Exactly. You feel me? I gotta open my bro. Y'all see what's going on? Y'all don't. It don't take no rocket science. Y'all see what's going on, man? <laughs> ain't nothing been right, man, since they went wrong, man. Talk to me about y'all creative process, though, man. When y'all getting in that studio and recording, how are y'all coming up with these bangers? Man, that's it's like it's easy, bro. Because like I say, Imani been doing her thing, and yeah, she write herself. You know, she write herself, bro. Like I'm talking about Imani I write a verse. Like she just did a feature. Somebody paid her for a feature the other day, and she wrote it in ten minutes. Mm. And I wanted them to see that. And then I went in there and recorded one take. Yeah, one take. Me, I one take. This. Matter of fact, I posted I on my I posted know. on my gram. Like she do this. I. A lot of people say she better than you, Turk. It's perfect. She's supposed to. <laughs> you feel me? She's supposed to. Anything other than me, man, they 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 bad. You yeah. feel me? Because yeah. you gotta step your game up. You can't be not better than me and I'm a living legend. Come on. She's just another legend in the making. That's it. Exactly. You feel me? So they think they be saying stuff like that to discourage me. I'm the husband you. <laughs> you feel me? I'm just saying. Like, I appreciate y'all from acknowledging that. Exactly. The money come the same place. We don't. Every time. We don't say how much money over here. We just spend. It's ours. Exactly. You feel me? So they don't it's understand. Always, it's ours. Keep that in mind. But I still, <laughs> I still need you to transfer. <laughs> I just spent some money just now then I saw her winning her purse and pull out the same exact what I spent I'm, I ain't say nothing then I just I just say man you need to transfer my money <laughs> <laughs> see what I'm saying and she be oh, budget you know how to win you Johnny you know I how to be I know wow. but, but, but then my wife exactly. like, exactly. like I was like you know, it ain't about our mo- the money. Ain't no issue it's with ours. me and my wife. It's ours for real. But hers is hers though, for real. <laughs> women, y'all know how the women be, man. Y'all Let me get back <laughs> in here though, man. Yeah. But y'all being married and being able to hold each other down the whole time. What is it like having your partner with you, going out here doing interviews, doing clubs, going into the studio and just making moves? Man, that feel good because if don't nobody got my back, he got my back. Come on. And if don't nobody got his, I got his. Exactly. We, I'm watching. And we been like, bro, you know what? I'm watching. We Who been like that. This girl was seven to eight months pregnant. We was coming from what, Texas or something? Somewhere, man. I, you know, I, I couldn't drive. I, yeah. I, I, I was a convicted yeah. felon, so I couldn't get behind yeah, a wheel and, and take no chance. Yeah. But I was able to drive. I was able to travel. Yeah. At one time, it was just me and her renting an SUV. Bro, one time she drove from Houston. It was Houston. We drove along. Bro, her place. feet had then swole up so, so big, big, bro. Big, you know what I'm saying? I was like, but on oh the road, God. like like she would drive. She went. We traveled all the way up to eight months, bro. Like we were gonna get the bag. Yeah. And she was with me with them twins. It was us four. And I meet. I got people in every city, so I make my entourage, man. I'm meeting with this dude, this yeah, dude. Yeah. Need my dude, so they coming out and they security. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? I don't gotta travel with y'all. Facts. I'm just paying our way. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They already there. Exactly. They, they want to come to the show. You feel me? <laughs> hey, man. Listen, man. They don't, but they already on print. Anywhere I go, man, I'm good. Anywhere I go, I'm good. Exactly. I'm certified, verified, man. You know what I'm saying? So I don't got no beef with nobody. Anybody that hate, man, they just hating. Because they either want to beat me or I ain't give them something. Come on now. You know what I'm saying? It's just simply that. You know, I don't got no problem with nobody, man. I'm going to speak my mind. I ain't going to bite my tongue because it hurt. You feel me? But, man, man, and he might have been rolling, man, since before the prison sentence. Yeah. After the prison sentence and right now. You know, it, it's, it, it's this ain't nothing new to us. Johnny. Having these two superstars on deck Ooh. and maneuvering again. I mean, what's going on with you? Because you stay busy. Stay busy, you know. But I just had to make time for, you know, for what it was, you know. Everything checked out. I mean, it's no denying it, you know yeah. what I'm saying? And I just want to see this man and his wife get they just do. Mm-hmm. You know, they deserve it. You know what I'm saying? He deserve. He's a humble person. She's a humble person. And they deserve it. Exactly. So you know we about to make it happen, and it ain't no stopping. It ain't no failing, and we definitely going up. And I could tell it's a difference this time because we we first of all he down here, and we stand in touch, and we already making moves. Like Thanks. moves already being made, money already being made. So it's already being talked into existence. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So it's just a matter of time before the you know what I'm saying the real big big bad come. 
Thanks. Bro, we working seven days a week. Like like I said, it's a plan. It's a strategy. Yeah. Johnny even putting it together. Look, we got this going on. I'm putting it. Look, we got this going on. And we... We on a group text. Exactly. exactly. You feel me? And I don't have to remind him. He don't have to remind me. I'm five minutes away. I'm that, and that's what I love about Johnny. I was telling my wife that. I said, man, Johnny, Johnny rolling with it. But I, I ain't call that nigga and remind him. Yeah. Because believing in my wife, like I believe in her, that's special to me. Exactly. You know, same with the people behind the scenes. You know, they don't be they behind the scenes. But, you know, it's, it's a lot of people, man, that's behind the scenes that don't like to be on the scenes that make this team grow. Yep. And people got to understand that you can't do things on your own. We not doing this on our own, you know, but everything is being driven off of us not procrastinating and being definite, having plans, you know, exactly. like everybody else is being a part of it, you know, but we all are beneficial. Ain't no big eye, no little use because everybody is beneficial, man. Thanks. Everybody. Now, I know y'all shooting a documentary as well. Yeah, 52 Bullets, man. You know, um, I've been contemplating on that for a minute. person that I had was the person that I need. I came right to the A and found the person that was supposed to be. Exactly. With the same energy. The Come law on. of attraction. Exactly. Shout out to Moses, man. He what here up, right now. He gonna split the Red Sea and y'all no he behind the scene. Come on now. Y'all don't see him, but exactly. he here. Exactly. He here you working. Me? So it's 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 like stuff like that, bro. Mm -hmm. You know, and he was at the other event, the other I, he was at the he was at the concert. I the, didn't even know. I that. didn't even know. He said, man, you know that was my my um monitors all over. Yeah. He sent wow. me the footage. I I know. Attraction. Just see <laughs> I ain't even know. So wow. it's like I'm I'm about to start casting for um Reckless, which is the movie. We looking for the young Turk, the middle Turk, and the shootout Turk. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? We gonna start casting in the A, so y'all stay tuned for that. Mm -hmm. You know, we got the reality TV show. We got some shows that with networks that you know when you get the networks you can't talk about it. Yeah. So. But um a lot of things we have turned down, we have revisit because we in a better position and we in a better place right now. Yeah. You know where we at. But um man, we working, man. But right now it's all about Imani, man. Mm -hmm. Bitch you cap, single dropping um on the twelfth. Video done. You know what I'm saying? We got the show next week on the twelfth. Out here in the eight. Yes, sir. You know. It all right, this week. This yeah, week on the twelfth. Yeah, this week on the twelfth, you know. Um Two days. <laughs> yeah, Friday. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, you know, um we just had the show with Rick Ross, Trina, um, um, City Trick Girl. Daddy, City Girls, you know, Imani. That's our that was our first big show. Ooh. That's our that's our first show. It was big. That was my first time performing uh Bitch You Cap. Ain't Talk no, to ain't no me, Imani. Shit. How was that when you hit that stage? You on there with some big artists. Big yes. artists. What's happening? I, I ain't had like, no shit oh like that when God. I came out. She did, though. <laughs> you, know, you know what? To see myself on a flyer with, you know, Trina, City Girls, Rick Ross, yeah. Trick Daddy. I'm like, Turk, I'm like, what the hell is going on? I and said, she a okay, fan. She a fan. Okay. Matter of fact, she a fan of Trina. And, yeah. and the bitch you cap, she make reference of Trina. I don't Ooh. know if Trina caught it, but... I love to see Trina on that remix, Johnny. Yeah. yeah we might get on that. <laughs> yeah. That's easy. We're going to make that. Yeah. That's going to be hard. She made reference to Trina on that. So.